Hello YouTube, in this video I'll be showing you how to remove branding from your login screen. So as you can see in my login screen I have Windows 7 Ultimate and I'll be showing you how to remove this. So log into Windows and then go to this link which will be in the video description and download Rizzle Saka. You can download it from the Europe server or the Australia server. I've already got the file. I'm just going to open it with WinRAR and run the exe file or application. Once you're in Resource Cycle, you want to go to File, Open, then go to Computer, C, Windows, select Branding, BaseBird, and then BaseBird.dll. Once you're in here, expand Bitmap, then expand. 120 and select 1033. Right click on 1033 and select delete resource. Then hit yes. And now go in resource hacker, go to file and then select save as. Go to your save it to your desktop, save it as basebird.dll. Basebird.dll. There's no i. So it's B A S E B R D dot D L L. Then hit save. Close Resource Hacker. Then go to My Computer. C. Windows. Branding. Basebird. Select Basebird dot D L L. Right click. Go to Properties. Security. Advanced. Owner. Go to Edit. Select your administrator. Hit OK. Then in Windows Security, hit OK again. OK. Then go to Edit. Select Administrator. Allow full control. Go to OK. In Windows Security, hit Yes. Then in the Properties, go to OK. And then rename the original file as basebird.dll.old. So basebird.dll.old. Then just uh, drag in your new one that you just made in Resource Hacker close Windows Explorer and then just log off. You'll notice that there's no branding at the bottom of your login screen as you can see here. And that's pretty much it. To restore the branding, go to Computer, C, Windows, Branding, Basebird, and then you want to delete the one that you just made which is active, delete, and then the one that you made dot old, so the original, I'm going to go to rename, and just backspace dot old, so you're left with basebird dot dll, and you should see the type will be an application extension, and just make sure that it has that icon here. And now if I just log off, you'll see that it goes back to the default, and it has the branding as you can see there it now has the branding and that's pretty much it so thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe if you like my videos and thanks again